Hello everyone, we hope you all are doing well and we are here with some quick hacks for you to cover you up for the ADT10 that's going to be upcoming on Radio. How you can use your existing player cards or the player cards that are already on the marketplace that will be in squads for these specific teams and that will save you some time in terms of buying packs and maybe you can buy some experience XP players from the marketplace to give you that edge and we have Nikhil Bai with us today to help you cover through these squads. Bilkul and also homework time as well. Uh, just before the tournament starts, we have talked about the AD data. Now, every team, lo, squad, take a look at which one you want to make. And then, once we get to the next slides, you will see how many people have already and how many people have XP. Ke. So then, you will be able to figure out in a much better way that you need more cards from which player or which player has missed out. And you uh, already had already already existing. Tha. So maybe it's a lesson for you that maybe this yeah, player will take it first. Le so, this is a strategy banana important. Hai. Uh, so, let's look at each, each squad and then we can, we'll be able to find out that okay, concept players are already in the market. So, form is a market value, pate chal, pata chal jayegi, whether it is overpriced hmm. or underpriced. Yes, absolutely. So, first up, we'll cover Team Abu Dhabi. And like you can see, for Team Abu Dhabi, these are the players who are already in the market. Fabian Allen, Brandon King, who should open for his team. So, can give you immense value. Darvish Rasuli, yeah. who is a very talented Afghani batter. And Phil yeah. Salt will again open the batting. And then Jamal Mills and Fizz on the other side, who will be key components with the ball. And all of these are key players because all of them are international players. So, should play an important role for their team. So, if you are getting any of them at scrap value in the marketplace, go pick them up right now because they'll be boosted up in value in just a few days from now. And there were a lot of players from them. And you can also pick with the form. If you hmm. go back to the previous T10 uh, uh, you know, tournaments and you see how they have done, when they have been used, and smartly pick your guys. Some uh, players are like that in T10 there are death overs. So it is better that you take somebody who is going to give you more impact in limited amount of time. Points say that you will eventually get. So points will be more than you will get. Yes, absolutely. And on the note of points, I guess this is a team that has a lot of points loaded up. Scherf and Rutherford, Roman Powell can bat, can bowl. Chris Green in T10 can bat, can bowl. Kenar Lewis will keep and open the batting. Wayne Parnell can bat and can bowl. And Vanindu Asranga can bat, bowl and can also be dream team captain multiple times. <laughs> so this team is the team to watch out for Northern Warriors. And they have a lot yeah. of all-round players. So if, again, if you're getting anyone at good value in the market, try and get cards that have already existing XP on them because that will give you a big nick. Absolutely. Now, look, there are a few players that you could keep an eye on. Something like Raya Dembre, if you see the squad, you should have seen that you should have seen it. These are also the guys who can run in and take few wickets up top. So, it's mandatory in every game. So, if you have cards, you will see them and see them. So, you can obviously use them to your advantage in that sense. Yes, absolutely. So that was the second team of the day. Now let's look at the third team that is in store for you. That is the Bangla Tigers and they have Evan Lewis and Colin Munro up top. Many of you would already have these cards if you played the CPL. Shakib yeah. Al-Hassan who will play a key role and again Mohamed Amir who already played in the CPL. Hazratullah yes. Zazai is also a good option. Just be certain about his injury status before you buy that specific card. And you अभी इंजर्ड है पर भाई साहब जब उनका टाइम आता है ना वो सेंचुरी पे मार देते तीस बॉल में तो ऐसे प्लेयर्स को छोड़ना नहीं ऐसे प्लेयर आपको एक दिन सीधा फर्स्ट लेके जाएंगे यस दे में टेक यू आउट ऑफ द विनिंग जोन बट सही दिन सही दिन पे यूज किया अगेंस्ट अ बोलिंग अटैक दैट मे नॉट हैव दैट मच स्पेस ही कुड विन यू अ कॉन्टेस्ट ऑल बाय हिमसेल्फ कुछ नहीं करा क्योंकि तब दिन ज्यादा लोग बैक भी नहीं करेंगे तो ऐसे प्लेयर भी आपके टीम में होने बहुत जरूरी है Yes, and that's also a good strategy. Like you mentioned, that when the player is injured, you might get him at good value in the marketplace yeah. and people might also try to offload their XP yeah. cards. So maybe that's a good chance for you to buy. So thanks for that, Nikhil Bhai. On to the Deccan Gladiators. And we have some familiar T20 faces here. <laughs> Nicholas Puran, Andre <laughs> Russell, Odin Smith. All of them who did not reach the Super 12. But all of them, when it's when it's these kind of formats, they'll be able to give you exponential returns. David Visa plays all around the world in T20s. Curtis Camphor, a man's favorite who's sitting here. Tuskin Ahmed, 
Mujibur Rahman and Josh Little all give you immense value with the ball and are rising stocks in terms of T20 leagues around the world. Absolutely. Look, Puran didn't get further than Vijayan sir, but okay. That is the love for him. But uh, some very great names here. Curtis Camper, uh, Joshua Little, they are all impact players. Now, Curtis may not get to bat and bowl in a lot of games, but when he does, he makes the impact. Joshua Little is in probably the form of his life. Bowling at good pace, getting good wickets. SFL ke aapke XP badao, use karo against right opponents, you could get handsome rewards. Or, jaysay amne kaha, this, there is a reason why we keep telling you ke aap zyada nahi to at least eight to pack kharid ke rakho, hmm. then you already have this place. Then you are not starting from scratch. So that is the advantage, kyun ke XP bhi better hoogi. So agar koi naya bhi system mein aa raha hai, khilne ko, to aapke was already a better XP card hai, jo aapko unke aage rakha hai. Yes, absolutely. Let's look at the next team that is on the cards for us. And yes, the pun intended on the cards. New York Strikers. Again, a familiar black card face for me. Kyron Pollard, Kesrik Williams, Azam Khan. All these guys, when you look at them, they might not be playing internationals a lot. But they do play a lot of these T10s and CPL. Yeah. They play those kind of leagues, PSL. So, yes, they will be of utility to you there. Akil Hussain would be my card to watch out for from this team because he can give you good batting value too. And Romario Shepard was also a similar in that kind of stature. Pinkul, I was just waiting for that one name and we didn't survive. We took it so happy. Good prediction there as well in my mind. But yes, you see, a lot of this or I have already played a lot. Kaafi Pays ke HP already bad ge hoongi aapke paas. Samila Kanazam Khan. Use these players very smartly. And these are a lot of golden right. boundaries, so these guys will really try to make best use of that. The strategy is very important. When you get to the shorter formats, the strategy becomes even more important. Which day, which type of player you risk player, that will also define how much the reward you get. Yes, absolutely. On to the second last team, the Chennai Braves. Here we have Banuka Rajapaksa who lit up this tournament last year. Even though I don't watch that much of T10, but from whatever I did, I remember that he was amazing. Sikandar Raza who is in the form of his life, Obed McCoy, who in any T20 league around the world at the death is going to be immense value and will on most days bowl 8 and 10 in this tournament. This is probably one team where you see all the players are massively important. They are hmm. all impact players. All can give you more than 50-60 points consistently also. Because they, they are that much in the game. Obed McCoy usually bowls in the end, takes wickets. Raja Paksha usually bats in the middle, continues to score runs. Sikandar Azad, Dasun Shanaka, Shakib Rasan, all round us in literal sense. I don't, I would be surprised if they do very well. Yes, so those are some key cards to you to pick out. And please ensure every time I tell you, share this video. But this time I'll tell you, before you share this video with anyone else, go buy those cards and only then share this video because they'll otherwise bump up the price of this in the market. And your last team is Morrisville, Sam Hami. And here you have key players, Shimran Hetmaya, who's surely not missing another flight. Johnson Charles, who will make great use of the smaller boundaries along with Miller and Moin Ali. Dwayne Pretorius, my personal favorite from this list. And when you go yeah. far right, as someone who I have backed a lot, Shamika Karuna. There's also a very personal favorite there, Moen Ali City Pointing. That's from this format. Very free to play cricket on the world. So, again, inform <laughs> David Miller, inform. Uh, Shadow Colton when he takes wickets. Crazy guy to back. So, these are all the guys that you can continue to back because they've done well. Johnson Chance is a proper domestic T10 player. Uh, he when he comes up, he'll have runs of scores like 40, 40, 40, 40. Marte they give a beach ball. So, yes, our players have a strategy. Banti hai, ke, uh, kaun si team is on the option. Hai, chalega, nahi chalega. So, all your options already available. Hai. So, please use them smartly in sub pay half of market test. Pe kya costing hai. and then ma pay risk. Lena chalo karo ke, okay, ye mera risk it there. Ye mera bank. So, you will be able to make much better returns if you have a good strategy. Please, there's also a brand that are before I miss out. If Ryan Zadran is used well, you have a handy support player. Again, this distribution is high hmm. impact player, bank support player. That is the one way also to look at the cards that you have. Yes, and if you value Johnson Charles highly, please freely take that card from me. <laughs> I back the other three players more. But yes, on that note, we'll close this preview. 
thank you so much to everyone who tuned in please keep an eye out on all of these cards so you get them at the value that you want them before they boost up in the market and then if you have some extra cards you can always sell them out and make some gains on that and we hope that all of you gear up well for the t10 have a great tournament have a good time guys with good challenges yes